this. So who do we got? You guys gonna watch it tonight? You gonna watch him outclass me in the ditto? Most likely. I mean, that's what recent sets have uh, proven. Melee make off money. Man, I don't know, man. I think that's a little. That doesn't sound too right. Next play, I appreciate it. I believe in you too. I believe in you believing in me. All right, all right. Game one. Which one? What do we look at? Do we look at that or this? Uh, this, these two are the same shit. Yeah. Okay. All right. All right. So. Um, recently, or they haven't played so much recently, but the last few sets they played, it has become pretty close to Lemon has been taking them. Yeah. Um, I have yet to recall if McCarty has actually taken a set off of Lemon. I don't think so, but he's come really close. Um, I know Mr. Lemon has played a lot with Sora, so he's, he's very familiar with uh, mine's big ass sword. Yeah. A lot of sword practice. That's gonna be a lot of what he looks for. He's gonna be looking for um, forward smash and just like unsafe aerials such as Nair. That was good spacing. I mean, wasn't ready for that one. And I think it's just because if you saw the coming out a lot of Oh yeah. Now he knows to shield. Yeah, you don't wanna. There's the tricky thing with Doc, right? His crash cancel is really good, yeah. and um, you have to really space your aerials well, especially at lower percents, or he will like down smash you and just win the trade off immediately. Um, we'll see how Makari tries to adjust to that crash cancel down smash. I would say probably don't be in the air as much. You know what I'm saying? Um, when you're in the air as Marth, it gives the other character a chance to get under you, which is exactly where you don't want to be as Marth. You don't want characters under you. Lemon's been doing really good. Lemon's been doing really good spot dodges. I think he's noticing that um, that Makari's a little bit too. He shows too much intent when he's trying to when he's trying to approach. So he kind of guesses when Makari's going to aerial and spot dodges, and he gets him up pretty much every time. Good dog. He's really smart. Yeah, Doc's had a weird weight where I don't know if like. Oh. So, for those of you that don't know, Makari has a list of players of shields he's broken in um, in tournament, and Lemon has just been added to this list. <laughs> I am on this list. Are you really? Yes, I am on this list. He has broken my shield in tournament, and he I think he has like eight, seven other players on his list as well. Oh my God, Makari, what a man! Sealed that stock, but hesitated a little bit. And have to strike the clear, you know, Kari, a player who definitely has a lot of confidence in his play. Right. It, uh, I just find it odd when he just doesn't follow through with things I know he'd be able to do. Mm -hmm. I understand. Let's see what he does for this edge guard. He up airs. I wanted to see a nair there personally. Um, like a reverse nair sending back off stage. But he gets that anyway. Um, doesn't take any percent. We're at last stock 0% each. I doubt he wanted to jab there. And there definitely could have been something better there. Right. Nice ball. Alright.
Stepping off already won the set. Oh, ah, no, he was looking for his water bottle. I was just <laughs> like, yo, I won this shit. Yo, if Jesse asks for mod one more time, ban him. You have my word. I own the stream now. Game two on FD. Mr. Lemon loves FD. He will take anybody to the stage. He'll even take ice climbers here, pretty sure. Thank you. Yeah, you know what to do. Pops hate I don't like it. And I know Lemon is a fan. He's really good at, like, just controlling space on the stage with the builds. Yeah. Most importantly. Yeah. Sorry in advance if I sound nasally stream. I've been, uh. I've been, yeah, I've been sick for like five weeks. Wow. Yeah, it's kind of crazy. Longest time. It's okay though. Once you uh feel better, you can achieve it. Oh yeah. I want to see a little bit of an aggressive edge guard play there. Um, the double jump, the double jump was a little bit unsafe. He was like kind of close to the stage, but like to the point where if he just jumped back in, um, fading backwards, there was no way. It was the risk reward was too great. Yeah, he could have like probably gotten a kill, and if he got hit or traded, like nothing would have happened. Uh, le nothing would have happened to Lemon. So I wanted to see a back air there, but he got the stock before he uses this one. He tries to jump out of that tipper setup. Um, I don't know if he was ready. Is that work? jumping out of it? Yeah, almost never. A bad di. Um, you definitely want to like at that at that percent, right? You want to hold towards the ledge and try to get to the ledge like that. Try to do something. Oh. <laughs> Great spacing on Akari on his shield. He's, um, when he's getting in the air now, he's being a little bit more patient, trying to see what Lemon's like committing to, what spot he's committing to, and just fading back or forward appropriately. Yeah, Akari can definitely keep that space. He can give Lemon a lot of trouble because he's just in there for a long time. I think most of it is due to the fact that Lemon kind of commits to a spot and shield um, more often than not. So like, he, he kind of like plays his hand, you know what I mean? If you're stuck in shield, you're stuck in shield. And he'll wait till Makari comes down. Yo, I'm about it one day, Racer. Josh, I'm down. Here's where things get a little bit tricky for Makari. It's always getting past the pills. Uh, you know, you can fare through them, but there's another one coming at you, so it's like, when's the right time? Uh, and Lemon will keep sitting on the pills. Yeah, Lemon is one of those players definitely that knows when to call it and yeah, just sure. finish it off. Yeah, that was a hard end there. The best weekly. What? Why? What's going on? Oh, okay. The run? Oh. Run to the car, You keep that shit in the car, bro. Run to the car, man. Shout out to Ainsbury, he's a shot. Which is that. It's definitely going to be a hard climb for me if he wants to. Pulls out the center right here. Where is this? No, this is 3 out of 5. What This is 3 out of 5. Is this it? So, you know, he's, he's still definitely has a lot of chances to make this work. Uh, I hate to say that.
Game three on Yoshi, so this is Pete's counter pick. Yeah. Currently one one. Don't know. Oh, no, it doesn't. Wait, Don't worry, I got you. Guys. Update. We got it now, though. No double jump on Lemon. Great ledge grab. I don't know if Lemon used this tornado at all. I didn't use this one. Tornado. I don't know if he did. I don't think he did. Great string. Wow. He's going off right now. Grab that ledge. That's not a stock. He definitely put in his counter to work right now. Yeah, but Harry's doing a great job of capitalizing. He really knows how to use the iPhone. Wow! Go. That was no, the tip was extremely up. early kill. So you see, I think this sta this is stage uh, benefits part greatly because he's able to get tippers at like 50%, but they don't kill on most other stages just because of how big they are. The opponents usually can be either, but here is one of the stages where a lot of the times it won't matter because he'll die early no matter what. <laughs> There we go, that's the aggressive edge play I was talking about. Uh, make, no. You could have, uh, after your fresh from bits ability, you could have uh, jumped back here and hit Yeah. And just that, Makari was trying to... Make Lemon roll towards him on the platform to make an easy tip. Kari's not giving him anything. Oh, he's definitely not. Wow, that's what I was talking about. So, 2 1 on the set count. Makari's favor right now. Probably going to the stadium. Definitely taking the second game in a dominating fashion. You know, if he can carry that momentum onto the third game, the set is pretty much over. Not get in his own head. Going to the stadium. I'm in second favorite. <laughs> Damn, son. I think the difference between, uh, you know, game two and the past two game that we've seen is Makari's moving a lot more. Yeah. Yeah, he's, he's just moving a lot more. But that's important. Yeah, but like, yeah. uh, it's like the pills aren't coming back. Right, Kari. I feel like now. That's a good point. Yeah, he's got teeth just to play them. Oh, 
such a good recovery as well as getting paid for the flex for everything. Oh, he's needing a lot of real damage right there. That's 60% of those. Alright, he needs his edge guard. Get to his head. I'm glad he was able to close that out early. Huh? I thought he was definitely going to struggle with that spot. No, it's my car. He's going to attack. See, I don't like that. That combo up. Yes, yes, two two. This is game five. Give it up. Thanks, man. I hope so. That's what's gonna happen. We'll see. Oh, it's nice to see Tech talking to each other. I know, right? Back Except to Battlefield. Shit, oh my god. Shifty, tripping balls. Yo, I didn't, I didn't check that. I definitely did not. Tech. I've been kind of caught by these dash attacks a lot. I don't know exactly what's getting him caught by these dash attacks, but... Wow, there you go. Wow, he landed again, though. Yeah, I was just surprised he touched the ground. Wake up, jab. Not gonna do any good. Wow. That's crazy. He has no jump. It would have been tricky there for Lyman if he didn't realize that Kari didn't have a jump, but yeah. good off. Just keep it focused. Also, that would be what they're saying. That's too high. Lyman gets too much out of Right. Uh -oh. Wow. That was good. When Lemon's in a position like that, he needs he needs to stay back. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Make Mark come to him. That's what's been working for him. Look at that. He definitely could have gotten a lot of on that. Right. Just like straight off. I agree. He was out of the corner too. Yeah. Kind of a desperation move. Wow, I made, that's that's dope. Sick. That's exactly what he needed right there. Yeah. Alright, going through these dash attack reads once again. Trying to predict where Lemon's going to land. Or see if he's going to try to wave dash forward after his yeah. pill so he can catch him with the dash attack. One step ahead of I think he adapted after four games of getting hit by it. Yeah, definitely. He's playing the spacing game a lot better. And that could fall me over right now. This whole life. Hmm. The tornado tripped him up there. But I just think the tornado is too far to hit him. There's his fear. Okay. That's, that was a great buffer roll out of the jab too. For those of you that like struggle with Doc, um, jab down smash is not real. Uh, you can smash the eye out or even just hold down and then buffer roll afterwards. Which is exactly what Makari did there so he didn't get hit by the down smash. 
and keeps him the stock. What a call on the neutral getup. So he keeps going for these capes, I just want to see him grab edge. Still not close enough for it to work, and he can just be going, like you said, for similar options. Right. That'll probably save him all the trouble in the set that he might get. Starts to do a lot of rolls and spot dodge when he's on last stock. And you know, when you're not attacking your opponent, you're probably not going to win. So he needs to recompose himself, even though he's at high percent. Very scary situation. Sick. Great spacing from Pete. That's it. 3 2. Yeah. Alright. Do you want us to go on? You want us to go up? Woo! Hope you're liking the stream, people. Got some pretty solid talent talent out here. Yeah, that was a nutty set. Is it good?